hi guys welcome to my channel um so you've seen if you haven't seen um i go from selling lashes and i now do nails um i'm a beginner nail tech or self-taught nail tech um so today i'm just going to be going over the acrylic collections that i have um the powders that i have the um brands that i use um i have a quite a few so bear with me um in front of me right here i have my mia secret is it mia secret yeah mia secret of course i have like a big not even a big thing this is like the one ounce of the cover nude blush i have like the jungle collection over here let me go ahead and separate these out oh she is not closed I have my jungle collection and the jungle collection really did come with like a lot of really nice colors like i'm really glad that i got it because i probably wouldn't have gotten these colors in a million years but i'm glad that i did okay screw it oops i'm gonna go ahead and just flip these over so But over here, oh, I already have them all. I have the Jungle Collection. Um, it comes with six colors. We have Foxy, Bunny, Jungle, Kitty Cat, Zebra, and Koala. Um, this is like a deep gray, a dark gray. More, This is more of like a lighter gray brown-ish color. This is, uh, the color of the cat is what the color of this is um that's kind of how i can explain it with these of course zebras are black and white so they kind of give you like a mix this is like basically another gray um the can't think of what this little animal is right now but the color of it is the color of this is like a really nice olive ish green it's a pecan Toucan. Toucan. It's a toucan. So the toucan is what the color of this is. Um, and then the koala. If you can see, um, which I don't think you really can see. Um, it's like a really nice light tan brown color here. So that's that collection. I didn't I just recently got this one and the um blues, I believe it is. It, like I said, each one of these come with a um, come with six colors, like each little pack. These are all one fourth ounce um, containers. This is like the blue, so you have Vegala, Blue Over, Let's Party, Blue Night, Capri Blue, and Selfie. Um, Vegala is one of my favorites. Honestly, I should just open these and show you guys. That is what she looks like. Let's see. This one is blue over. Why not? I haven't even used some of these yet, so bear with me. As you can see, she has some sparkle to her. This is Let's Party. She's a nice little neon green. Selfie. Oh, she's cute, cute. That's how she looks. Capri blue is like a really dark, like denim blue, which I definitely love. Um, blue night. I don't think I opened this one yet. No, I didn't. This is more like a denim blue as well, but with like 
nice little sparkles in it. A little bit of glitter. I will open these up lastly. By the blues, I have the Jungle Collection. Um, the first ones that I did get whenever I started off were these here. This is why I have um, like the swatches on them already. Um, so I can't think of what this collection is called. But it's one, like I said, it's one of the first ones that I started off with. I do have some singles that I'll show as well. Um, but this is my heart. You can already see the kind of swatch on the top. But to open her up, this is how she looks. If you can't see, let me see. That's how she looks. Um... Sweet Dream is one of my absolute favorites. That is how she looks. Let's see if I can. There we go. That's how she looks. She's really cute. Very chic. This is the swatch of it. And this is how it looks. I am cute. These come with like a lot of sparkle and I'm never gonna complain about that because I love sparkle. Um, in love, she's been used a bit, so yeah, barely anything in there. And Missing You is the last of this collection that I have. Um, I just recently got this one like maybe a couple months ago. I have been dying to get my hands on this collection. It's one of my ultimate favorites. Um, it's the Marry Me collection by Me a Secret. <sighs> Marry Me is just this nice little kind of holographic glitter. You can't really tell how it looks. I'll have to swatch these in another video. Um... This one is Bouquet. She's cute. Kind of like a little dupe for the um, Valentino Hidden Pleasure, but she has bigger chunks of glitter in her, which work really well with any combination of colors. This one, White Dress, is one of my all-time favorites. Um, if you can see the little swatch of it there, and that is how she looks. This, that's one of my all time favorite um, acrylics for me, a secret. Um, this one is Honeymoon. That's how she looks swatched. This is how she is in the package. Next one is Wedding Cake. Now she's, she's really cute. She's like really peachy, a little peachy with like glitter in it. And that is how she looks. And last but not least is Yes I Do. It's just a basic white acrylic with some um, iridescent holographic kind of um, glitter in it. And that is how she looks. Um, last two are like some samples that I got um, from my local nail supply. Well, actually I ordered this one. No, these both came from my local nail supply. Um, this is the Me Secret Vegas Night. It's just, it's really cute. If you can't tell from here, it's just clear with like pink glitter all throughout that's how she looks and then this is pink house she's a glow in the dark so you really can't tell how that looks but it's just a basic pink okay now that's it for my me secret but to show you how these look because i didn't open them i wonder why i didn't 
Um, this is Bunny, which she hasn't even been opened either. Let's see if I can get her. Mm, can I get her? Okay, skip. This is Koala. Jungle. I can see what I was saying about that green. I love this green color. Foxy hasn't even been opened. I'm gonna have to come in here with my box cutter in a little bit and open these. Kitty cat hasn't been opened, I think. No, she's opened. That's how she looks. And then zebra hasn't even been opened. Let me see if you work with me at least. Okay, no. Let me see if I can get a box cutter or something. Thank you. Not a box cutter, but she works. Okay, so Zebra, she's dark. She's the deep gray that I was looking for. I'm trying to like get away from using like nudes. This is Zebra. She's deep, almost like a black. Um, let's see, so Foxy is next. Okay, so this one's like a blue-gray mix. I like her. She's cute. And this is Foxy. So you can kind of tell what the color is based on like the background of where the fox is on. It's like a blue-gray. And then Bunny is the last one. So Bunny is a brown. Bunny is definitely a brown, like a gray brown. So this collection is basically all like gray tones, which I don't, I don't, I have no problem with. So that is my Mia Secret. Um, newest to my collection, and she just came in the mail today, is my Valentino's. Um, I got the 80s collection. This is my first set of Valentino anything. Um, I've been waiting and waiting and waiting. Um, USPS kind of lost one of my first packages from them not too long ago, and I'm still waiting. I ordered it like a month ago, and I had to call them today to see if they can get it actually shipped out to me again. But this is the second set that I ordered, um, and it just came today. Um, so like I said, it's the 80s collection. It's like it runs $79.99. So not bad for the amount of colors that you get. And then, you know, their pigments are perfect. I swatched them earlier. I just have to do it again on a separate video for you guys. Um, but this is color number 110. It's like a nice bright neon orange. And the next one is 114. Um, she's like a really subtle, nice pink color. She's not subtle. She's, she's, she's cute. Next one is 115, which is definitely like a bright like neon purple, but she's dark. Whenever you apply her with this, when you swatch her, she's dark, but I like it. Um, next one is 113. I can't explain what this color is. I call it a teal color that's just how I see it but that's how she looks um this one is 112 just a nice bright green which I absolutely love and needed like a a bright green like this let's see Next is 111. She's she's my favorite. She's a bright neon yellow, and I love 
love it. The last two. Um, this one didn't come with a color number, but she is like a coral, like deep coral color. I call it coral, but it's probably something different. This is how she looks and she's really cute. I promise it's not a red. And then the last one is a hot pink and this is 108. And this is how she looks. And then for the inconvenience of it, it, it didn't get here late in my point of view, but they did give me, send me free the Valentino Beauty Pure Diamond Gel. So of course I have not used it yet. It's sealed up. I'll use it one of these days. Um, my biggest collection that I have right now is my Hey Beautiful collection. Um, this is my local nail store. Um, I live in Texas, so obviously, you know, having a local nail store is always the best. Um, this is just a clear. I have two clear in here, so I'm not even going to go into those. Um, this is G104. It's a green glitter. And she looks like that. I have some of these kind of swatched. Hold on. Let me see if I can. Okay, so the one I just showed you is this one that is how she looks um some of these are new so i don't have like a swatch for everything in here black empire is just a black i recently just did a set with this but yeah that's how she looks she's just black um red YouTube video. Oh. <laughs> oh. Well, I start again, sorry. Very good. Why is my glass in here? Hmm? Cook. Oh. <laughs> Tomorrow. Okay, girl. Bam, bam, bam. You do? You do? I got you, girl. I got you. Like I said, I don't have a lot of them swatched. Um, I haven't been yet to number these. I know what some of them are, but these are like the swatches that I have from Hey Beautiful because Hey Beautiful was um, my second, um, my second company that I started using. So I have all of these here. I will go into them. Oh, and these back here are the marry me collection swatched and this is of course a white dress she's really cute she real cute but going back to this showed you guys red paradise it's kind of it's probably going to be the same as the purple i just showed you with a valentino yeah emerald she's cute um this is morning orange that's how she looks 
Um, this is Alpha 1001. You can see her as she's so much at the top. And then that's her. She's really just holographic and I love it. Um, bright yellow, basically the same as the other yellow with Valentina. Here she is. Just like a bright neon yellow, basically. Um, the neon orange. Yeah, she cute. She's really, she's really nice. Um, cover snow, which is basically a white. It's like a soft white. So here is the this. It's just a soft white, honestly. Cover nude, which of course I use a lot of. So things basically empty, but I have another one in here. Ignore this. I was starting off and I was using this. So of course I have like the clump that just did not come on my brush. Um, Azura, is that nice? Blue. That's how she looks. She has a little bit of sparkle in her. Neon pink. Yeah, she's bright, but she's one of my other favorites. Next, I'm going to show you um, Tortilla. Tortilla. I don't have her swatched. She's new, new. But she's a really nice, pretty brown. I had this on my nails once. But that is her swatch. She's like a really nice brown, like a light brown, tan beige color. Dark butterscotch. She's pretty swatched. Um, let me see if I can get her so I can show you what she looks like. This one here is dark butterscotch. That's how she looks. Um, cover peach. I have a lot of cover colors. I need cover colors. I love cover colors. Um, I think I recently just bought her not too long ago from the store. I'll swatch all of these on another video for you guys, I promise. This is Magenta Haze. She's like a prone eggplant color. Oop, she leaked. Next is Rosa 101. She's nice. Royal blue. I keep getting this one dirty. This one is Call Me. Um, they actually let me have this color free because I spent like 400 bucks in there one day. We just not even gonna go into that. But this is what she looks like. She cute, cute. I keep up. If you can see, this is Cover Peach. This container has been used a lot. I'll go in here one of these days and empty out the the dried up acrylic that kind of just sank to the bottom. But that is Cover Peach. This is 105. It's that yellow glitter that I showed y'all a swatch. Yeah, this is one of my sister's favorites. 
um, Lily Light is a really pretty, nice pastel purple. She's so pretty. I cannot wait to really do a set with this one day. Um, soft Peach. It's really a soft color, honestly. A nice soft color. Strong Mint. That is how she looks. Yeah, I pulled out the whole drawer for you guys. So you can see, because there's going to be too many to kind of take out and keep showing you guys. Um, if you can't see my mistake, which I'm pretty sure you can't, I went into Hey Beautiful one day and I bought Peachy. And then me not realizing, nor going back into the drawer, I ordered another Peachy because, oh, she's so cute. So I have two Peachies. So, and I haven't used either of them so one of them i might give away or i might just keep um i have swatched them both though um so i'm only gonna open one of them she is peachy that's all i can say she's peachy the next one i'm going to show you is barbara She's like a light pink. She's a light pink. I can't say pastel, but she's pink. I'm trying to put them in order, not even in order, but like neatly. Did I show you guys cover nude? I did, so I'm not gonna do that. Butterscotch cream. And this is her, she's, this is honestly one of my other favorites. I have a lot of favorites when it comes to my acrylic powders and what I use. But yeah. Um, saffron is another gray color that I have. This is her. She's got like a nice light gray. Okay, cover fairy. I thought this was uh, gonna be the dupe for me for the Hidden Pleasure by Valentino. I thought wrong. It, she's cute though. You just put her on top of any kind of set and she brings like that glitter to it. And I love that, that sparkle that you want. Um, 71 is like basically dark butterscotch, but with glitter in it like gold yellow glitter i didn't even really show her i'm sorry i put her off to the side because she's super small um mango which is now on the website as mango 2.0 um she is cute um let's see here she is swatched she does not look like this she's a little bit darker and i can show you This is how she looks. I said a little bit darker, so that's how she looks. She's also one of my favorites. Um, sparkling orange. Basically, kind of like butterscotch cream, but with glitter, sparkles, a little love. Um, next is Red Rose. She's just a pretty shimmer color that is how she looks um two more olive okay now this one here i can honestly say she was not one of my favorites um i tried to do an ombre set on my sister and she was very hard to blend. She didn't really want to take the monomer well. Um, but I mean, I bought her, I'm going to use her. She may not be my best friend, but we're going to make her work at some point in time. 
Um, but here is Olive. I do not have a swatch of her. Um, but I will, like I said, I will swatch the monomers with the monomers, the polymers, and like another video for you guys. But that is how she looks. And you will see what I mean when, like, when I pick her up on the brush. She's a little bit difficult to work with. Um, last but not least for Hey Beautiful is Cover Cotton Candy. It's just a pink it's like a nude not even a clear pink if you swatch it it just goes on top clear basically with a pink like tone to it and that is all now the reason why i kind of stuck them in there all crazy to begin with is because i have these bigger colors that don't even really fit in here but we make them fit so she's gonna go back oh look and i still got my clears see and this is how this happens where they fit. If you're wondering where I got these drawers from, I got them from my job. Um, they are on sale. Um, I think they're still on sale. I think. I'm not sure anymore. I just work here now, so yeah. Um. Lastly, what I have to show is my nail supply glamour. I only have three with more on the way. I just placed an order for them not too long ago, but these are the three that I got from them to begin with. Um, and we will show you guys. So these two are practically the same, but she's my darker one and she's honestly one of my favorites. She is the lightest. Ignore how damaged she is. I left her on the paper towel with the monomer on it and she was getting eaten. I I apologized. I apologized to her and I just I just feel so bad. But and this one here is like a purple. So this one I did a set on my best friend with. Um I will insert a picture or show y'all in a later video how that set came out with this purple. But this is how it looks. And then P363, I'm gonna put these two side by side for you guys. And you can see the um, color difference between the two. She's definitely darker and she's lighter. So yeah, I love this one the most. Um, and then that is all for my acrylic powder collection. Um, when it comes to like glitters and whatnot, I use um, I use Martha Stewart glitter, and I use Nestle Pie Glamour glitter. Um, I make my own little glitter mixes, but you know, yeah. Um, I have my little glitters and these little containers Martha Stewart glitters have really been like my help um and I will forever cherish them because she has helped me make some really nice combinations when it comes to glitters for the nails um if you can't tell sugar cube is my all-time favorite one I use her way too much but she's one of my favorites. I'm not gonna open these because they do kind of get messy and I don't feel like, you know, dealing with that. Um, I also have, I had these kind of separated by color at first, but then I don't know what happened. But this is like the pink purples-ish. You can see the, the different shapes that it comes in. This is like my chunky glitters. And then we have like the hollow, the regular hollow, the blue hollow, and some little stars as well. Um, when I say Martha Stewart glitter, I mean Martha Stewart glitter. I can't even, I don't even know. Is it Kunzite? Kunzit? Whatever. Kunzite is. I will open her for you guys. Um, that is how she looks. 
um she she's really pretty i will have to show you guys a nail that i have her on um i have sugar cube in a big bottle i have smoky quartz in a big bottle i have what is this one build spar in a big bottle and then i have lemon drop in a big bottle from martha stewart um i just recently bought some more as well and these will probably conclude the video but let me bring you guys up just a little I just bought these not too long ago. Well, not even not too long ago, like a couple days ago. Um, each each pack of these come with 12. Um, and you really get the bang for your buck. I can't tell you how much I pay for this. I also got these from my job. So, um, yeah. Oh, look, I have more of that one. I didn't even realize. I know I got Sugar Cube. but And I know I got more the Chunky and the Chunky of this one. But I truly, like, I love her glitters. They make a difference when it comes to, like, the nails. Um, the other one that I got, because I didn't have, like, one like this. So kind of, like, my pinks, my purples, my blues, greens, or whatever. This is how they look. Um, they all have like the little names and stuff on them. Oh, she's cute. Jelly Bean is cute. Go back in there. I didn't really realize this one. I think this is the one that caught my eye. I just didn't realize like how pretty she actually was. Mm, she's cute, cute. Um, for today, that will conclude our video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Like I said, for the probably the fourth or fifth time, I will come back and I will do a swatch over all the acrylics that I have. Um, so just, you know, be prepared, be on the lookout. And thank you for starting this nail journey with me. Bye.